to show up and we get to pick up trash and it just makes us feel like a million bucks. There you go. Armed with trash bags, litter pickers, and disposable gloves, these volunteers showed up bright and early and ready to work. Today is our 23rd annual Trash Bash and we have over 700 people uh, registered to come out today to support our cleanup. And the goal for today is to uh, pick up litter before it gets into the Elm Fork of the Trinity River. The Trinity River is where we all drink water, so it's really important to keep it clean. You get your stuff right over here, here and the shirt's going to be in the back. Volunteers lend a helping hand by walking through Campion trails and picking up trash along the way. It makes me really glad. Today we actually have a record number of volunteers, which is 700, and that just means that the message is getting out there and people are coming out and they also learn about the Campion Trail, which I think is a wonderful asset to Irving. If we start reaching out to them at a younger age and getting them volunteer at a younger age, then it's become second nature to them. I'm a Girl Scout troop leader here in Irving. We have a troop of about 26 girls and usually at these events about half of our troop shows up to help keep Irving beautiful. Last year we had 503 people come out and we collected several thousand pounds of trash and another 400 pounds of recyclables. Those recyclables are diverted away from the landfill into a recycling center thus increasing the lifespan of our uh, landfills. Despite having a common goal, there are different plans of attack. Whichever way everybody's going, we'll usually go the other way. A game plan, you know what, I think uh, my experience tells me that some of these people are going to look for the easy, low-hanging fruit, you know, the easy trash to pick up, and I have to kind of go back behind them and take a sweep and, and uh, put a second set of eyes on it and get that little stuff that they missed. Herpetologist Barry Allen stopped by to provide some safety tips for volunteers and show off his impressive snake collection. It doesn't feel slimy or anything, but it's, uh, it feels like a boot, <laughs> like a boot just wrapping around you or something. It's just like, it feels gross. It's just soft. The Trash Bash is part of a nationwide effort called National Public Lands Day where volunteers get together to clean up parks for families and our little friend here to enjoy. Being able to give back to the community makes us all feel really good. Even the little girls, they walk away knowing that they've done something very, very good for their community. We need the KIB and all of these folks that care about Irving, care about the, the environment. You know, it's ours to take care of and, and uh, that's what we should do. Events like the Trash Bash provide residents a hands-on opportunity not only to keep Irving beautiful, but also have fun while doing so. Bernardo Frias for City Source.